you might be wasting your money on real vanilla extract. The main flavor compound we associate with vanilla is vanillin. In real vanilla extract, vanillin, along with over 250 other aromatic compounds, come from soaking the seed pod of the vanilla orchid in at least 35% alcohol. Its deep brown color comes naturally from the tannins and the pigments in the pod. Imitation vanilla is mostly just synthetic vanillin, dissolved in water or propylene glycol, and it tastes noticeably one-dimensional. Vanillin used to be made from a wood pulp byproduct of paper manufacturing called lignin, not to be confused with a ligma. Now, about 90% of vanillin is synthesized from petrochemicals, byproducts from crude oil processing. Imitation vanilla usually contains no alcohol and it's clear unless a food dye like caramel coloring is added. That said, both have their place. Imitation vanilla is great for baking since heat destroys most of the delicate compounds in real vanilla extract and the flavor ends up being pretty similar. Clear imitation vanilla is also used for white frostings or glazes where you want to avoid the dark streaks that come with natural vanilla. So save real vanilla extract for cold or low heat recipes like whipped cream, custards, or ice cream. That's where you'll actually notice those complex flavors that you're paying for.